It's live from the asylum, starring Michael Workowski. Elise Vino. <laughs> Carolyn Vesho. <laughs> Jennifer Prescott. Aaron Shore. And Sam Zellbrier. <laughs> and tonight's suggestion is... I have it right here, Sammy. Sammy boy. Secret meeting. Secret, Secret meeting. meeting. <clears throat> Secret meeting. Secret meeting. God, I'm alone. Oh, shit. Hey, Carolyn. Jennifer, who told you to be here? I got a post-it note on my door. It just said, show up 8, I'm sorry, 9.03 p.m. Down in the kitchen for a big surprise. I came down. Here I am. I mean, here we are, and we're the only ones. What? Did you also get a post-it note on your door with the same note? I did, and it was orange. And that's my least favorite color post-it note. Oh, that's gross. It feels kind of personal. Mine was written in calligraphy. What? Was Mine your... was not. No, no, it was the messiest handwriting. I could have sworn like a six-year-old wrote it so they've got multiple people on this this is this is a coordinated effort i wonder if anyone else got the i don't think anyone else got the invite i think just you and me hi oh <laughs> you're here aaron. it's me aaron how you doing i got a note mm. What color post-it was your note? It was yellow, my least favorite color. <laughs> Mine was chartreuse. Listen, Aaron, you're looking a little funny around the gills. Did I have too much to drink last night? Carolyn, you're looking weird too. I, I don't know. I feel a little like bloop -de -doop. I think you're a little bloop de doop I'm perfectly <laughs> normal. Nothing's different about me. Yeah, same here. This is how I always look. Yeah. And okay, that's also, it's totally just me. I just, I must have eaten a bad mushroom <clears throat> or a clam casino. I, you, you really ought not order the clam casino at the asylum. Just for the record, don't do it. Chef recommends, not good. <clears throat> Jesus Christ. I hear ya. Suddenly, so the doors slam shut and a wide, clear window opens. <laughs> you all got my post-its. <laughs> oh my God, Elise, you look so fresh and healthy. I've never seen you look more glowy. Oh, thank you. Thank you, it's, it's a new concealer. I'd love to borrow it. <laughs> I'm so glad that you all decided to be a part of my new social uh experiment what exactly was this experiment well i was planning to lock you inside this room for a period of time to be determined is that it is that the end of the experiment you're just going to lock us in a room for an undetermined amount of time well i hadn't thought that far ahead i was just Will drawing it up Will snacks be provided? Oh, dang it. You've got me with the details. I don't know about snacks. 
Will we get a note to bring to our boss for missing? Oh my God, with the questions. Okay, Elise, I love your vibe and clearly yoga camp did you a world of good, <laughs> but this is a little creepy. I, I'm someone who likes to be in control. <laughs> Well, we know that, but there's other ways. Like you could lead an activity where the door is not locked. But I'm sorry, I I just don't feel like that would suit the the purpose of this experiment. Okay, so what exactly are the parameters of this experiment? We're in okay. a room, we're locked. We don't have any snacks. We don't have any note for our work. Exactly. So I thought it was a great because I had this dream just the other night where I was locked in a room with no snacks, no notes for my boss or anything. And I thought, what imaginary activities might I come up with? And I was drawing a blank. So I thought, what if I use three of my close friends to collaborate on that same idea? And that's when you'll get out when you collaborate. Uh, you really have not explained anything about what we're going to be doing in this room. Ah, ah, but that's that's up to you. You're the creative minds. I had a dream that all my teeth were really gummy and started to fall out of my mouth. And then my eyes got really gummy and started to fall out of my head. Does that mean anything to anybody here? Well, we're supposed to collaborate on something. So maybe um, I could pretend to be the eyes and Jen can pretend to be the gummies and we'll satisfy our friend's little plan here to create something together. Well, yes, that would please me. Okay. Oh, I'm not <laughs> looking for a way out or anything. I think what? we should cut to the bar with Michael and is it Sam? <laughs> Michael. Michael. Meow. Michael. Meow. Michael. Meow. Michael. Meow. Hey, Michael. I I want you to call me Tunes from now on because because I like tunes and I like singing them. <laughs> you look. You look weird. You don't have opposable thumbs. For fuck's sake, Sam, I'm trapped in the body of a cat. Oh, okay. That's weird. Uh, <laughs> is there anything I can do about that? I think Elise is a witch, and I think she sent my soul into the body of this feline beast. <laughs> yeah, that checks out. Do you want <laughs> to see some of the your traps? It tracks, I said. God damn it. Oh, that tracks? Okay. I've, I've got a lot of hair over my ears. Do you <laughs> want to see my prop comedy? Well, hell yeah. I'm a big fan of comedy. <laughs> okay. So I'm up on stage, and I just start waving this around. I'm like, hey, you're going to like my act. <laughs> Do that. I guess that's the first that's one. Freaking genius. I love it. Go second on. One is, oh, second is this. I take this out. I'm like, hey, can I knife you a question? Ah! Really just around. Yeah, okay. I'm your biggest fan, Sam. Did you want to see the third one? Oh, you're gone. <laughs> <laughs> the third one was really casting a spell. Elise. To Elise casting oh. a spell. Elise. Well, uh, withers and ashes, dust to dust, tombstone and brimstone and everything nice. Elise, what are you what are you doing? I thought you gave this up. I'm <clears throat> whipping up a spell. No, no, honey, no, come on. Put 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 down that cauldron thing. You're spinning around. But I, I must. 
remember last summer you like lost your whole like rest of your life to witchcraft oh but i i've transformed i'm a different person now elise i brought the eye of newt thank you <laughs> and also should i cut my hand i only need the nail so you want me to pop off my nail please <laughs> See, I'm merciful. He didn't have to take his hand. Well, that was never the issue. I mean, I always knew that you were a, a good witch. It's just that, I don't know, it was just taking over your life and it, it got in the way of other things like our friendship. And you're being an enabler, by the way. <laughs> I'm an enabler? Yeah. Oh. I'm just trying to support my friend do their witchcraft we are collaborating i'm a collaborator <laughs> cut to skippy in the back alley <laughs> dude man i got this really sweet ass calligraphed invitation to meet <laughs> someone back here in the back alley and there's nobody here god damn it skippy got stood up <laughs> That sucks. I'm, I'm angry. Hey, oh. baby, come around here often. <laughs> oh, were you the one that invited me to the uh, back alley uh, fun fest? Oh, you bet I did. And this is a fun fest for two. Oh, one of them. I see what this is all about. Maybe you've been watching my OnlyFans. <laughs> I've been watching your OnlyFans, and I've been watching you smoke outside that lemonade stand on I've... That's all I do on my OnlyFans channels, I smoke outside a lemonade stand. <laughs> Gets me a uh, pretty good revenue. You don't That's... believe what people are into these days. No, <laughs> totally. And I'm just struck by the simplicity. My last lover was so complicated. are you getting hot right now yes i thought so <laughs> tell me about your last lover go ahead uh, my last lover was like this uh he was he was like this career criminal and he like stole cars for a living and like stole cds and uh it was it was it was a while ago Clearly, it it got me out of the love market for a while, but um, you know, after spending some time away, I I came back and I'm just looking for somebody who. Uh, I gotta ask: Is a way a euphemism for being in the joint? <laughs> you know, the pokey, the big house. When you said away, it is. It I is. Knew, I didn't I give him up. I didn't give him up. I didn't name him. I didn't name him. I was in love. And then he got away with no time. And I got 10 years in the slammer, Skippy. Can we cut to Carolyn in jail? <laughs> wow. That was an amazing story. I'm so sorry that that happened to you. Yeah. Um, so I don't have my commissary in yet. So um, I mean, empathy is nice, but what I really need is someone to get me just some ramen Ooh. and juice. Can you hook me up? I'd probably do you a solid <laughs> this time. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> They call me Bones. I'm the ramen <laughs> person around here. Yeah, this is your hookup right here. Oh, dope. Thank you. you hey, want, Bones. You want chicken ramen? You want beef ramen? You want ham ramen? You want <laughs> finger ramen? You want cat ramen? Finger ramen. Oh, my gosh. It's been so long since I've had that. And if you need a beverage, you can come back around to me. I got some toilet sangria brewing right now. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay. Okay. Um, is there a finger sangria too to go with my finger ramen? Ooh. Oh, absolutely. Here, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Cut to uh, the same prison with the same guard, but Elise is now in prison. That's where she really was instead of being in a yoga retreat. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. I, he told me he wanted to be a cat. <laughs> it's so unfair. Well, a jury didn't believe you, so now you're here with me. I told you, girl, I told you over and over that no. that witchcraft is no good. No, I know, but, uh, you know, those cards and the, the, the spinny thing and the zodiac, it's all so enticing. I never thought anything evil would come of it. Yeah, well, sometimes what it's enticing is not always what's good for us um but you know what is good for us ramen what? they've got so many different kinds in here with all that sodium yeah wow. yeah did someone say ramen <laughs> <laughs> it's me bones. bones 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 this is this is my friend elise can you um can you hook her up with some um Ah, what would be a good type of ramen for... Something laced with drugs. You want <laughs> drug ramen? Oh, please. Do you want uppers, downers, sideways, interdimensional? Oh, yeah. could you mix the uppers and downers? I want to feel medium. <laughs> you want to feel just normal? <laughs> you could eat yeah. regular soup for that. Let's have it balance it, balance it out. Okay, here, I'll add these two soups together, uppers and downers, and you just have to drink it out of my hands. <laughs> <laughs> get get Girl, your so, lips up in there. I'm mm. so proud of you, Elise. This is really good judgment. Mm, I'm, I'm getting a uh, lavender hand cream flavor in there as well. <laughs> that would be my hand cream. Bones <laughs> <laughs> is full of surprises. Mostly oh my God, just bones. soup. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. No, but the, with the the lavender, that reminds me. You know when you came, when you like snuck into my bunk in the middle of the night and put that like lavender oil stuff on my pillow. I think Elise would really like that too. So you want me to sneak into Elise's bunk and cover her with lavender oil while she's sleeping? Yes. <laughs> yes. I love it. Try and stop me. <laughs> You're gonna cover um, all of me. That's that's a lot, lot of inventory regarding head oil. to toe. You get, <laughs> you get this the lavender special. <laughs> uh, I didn't even uh, Gladys with uh, Sam at the bar. <laughs> well, young gentleman, are you still up on that ladder? Yeah. You've been up there since two episodes, and I wish you would come down and serve me an old fashioned. <laughs> is is that what I think it is? Well, yes. <laughs> it's what you think it is, and a bit more too. <laughs> well, you've always been my favorite mixologist at this bar, also my favorite comedian. <laughs> Thank you. I Thank love you. the way you handle your props. <laughs> That's hot. Okay, I'm coming down. Yes, clamber down, clamber, <laughs> clamber, clamber, clamber. Oh, yes, now we're on the same level. Could I have uh, my old fashioned? <laughs> okay. There you go. Oh, <laughs> Take it. I took it. God damn it. It's right here. Hey. <laughs> You, you want to see one of my jokes? <laughs> Indubitably, I love them. Now, my sister Mirabelle is not the biggest fan of you. I'm going to reveal that right now. She doesn't like your comedy, but I love it. I whisper your jokes to myself at night. Go ahead. Okay, so Gallagher used to um, smash a watermelon with a sledgehammer. <laughs> but 
what what I am going to purport with props is take honeydew melon and put it back together. <laughs> going to reassemble okay. the melon? Yeah, okay, wait. But you're touching the wait. melon a lot, and I feel like your fingers wait. are very grubby and it's gross. I don't... I, I can't control that. <laughs> okay. I, feel, I feel a little bit... Is... Oh, go ahead. That's it. That's the melon. Bazinga. <laughs> you don't like it. I'm afraid it went right over my curls. <laughs> well, yeah. Sam, it's all right. Every genius can have a bomb now and then. Cup to Gladys bringing some of the melon back home to Maribel. Mm. Mirabelle, uh, Sam told me a very, um, I would say, mediocre joke tonight. Oh, but why am I not surprised? <laughs> I know you don't like his sense of humor, but I, oh, I find him just delightful. But I did get a quantity of melon chunks out of the exchange. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> lovely. Um, we could have a little pokey pokey with a sporky sporky. <laughs> oh, that sounds lovely. Gladys, thanks. Now, um, Gladys. Um, yes? Before I get into this melon, you didn't notice my hair. I went blind. Oh Goodness, Mirabelle, it is gorgeous. It looks lovely. You must have gotten the extensions and the locks and the tra uh, training and the. Again. You faded out there for a second. I again. Oh my God, your hair, it must be obscuring your vocals. But anyway, um, I think that Aaron is going to be very entranced by you. Oh, that's so sweet. I always liked that. I know he wants to just remember that time that he made a sandwich with us and he was the meat in the middle and we were the bread on the side. But he has an eye for you, Mirabelle. He loves you. Aaron, go find him. I think you should arrange a secret meeting. <laughs> I think so too, Gladys. In the elevator shaft. Nice. The elevator shaft that was repaired in season four. <laughs> Give him a post-it note. You, he'll find you. That's the best way to contact anyone these days. It's the future post-it note. Cut to the secret meeting in the elevator shaft. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> um Yeah. Quick problem. I cut my hand very badly and ripped off all my fingernails for Elise's spell. No worries, honey. You know what? I carry a band-aid and neosporin everywhere I go. Come give me those sweet hands, baby. Okay. Okay. So Maribel is going to fix that right up. Can I have kisses, too, on each finger? Oh! So, Aaron, you notice anything different about me? Uh, nope, nothing at all. <laughs> oh, well, that's interesting. That's hold, interesting. Hold on, I'll take a closer look. <laughs> nothing, nothing. I'm getting nothing. <laughs> oh. Wait, well, hold on. One second. Uh, yeah, sorry. You had a eyelash. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I did, didn't I? I did, didn't I? Maybe, maybe what you're saying, Aaron, is I was as beautiful then as I am now. <laughs> you were as beautiful when as you are now? <laughs> Last time you saw me. Last time I saw you, yeah, you looked exactly the same as you do now. <laughs> oh, this is a go of the way I lived. Uh, cut back to the room that people are trapped in. <laughs> in the beginning. <laughs> they forgot about us in this goddamn room. And there's no way out of this goddamn room. There is the door. There we is a door. There's no window. Try. The door is unlocked. What? Yeah, you, it's been unlocked. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I've just been leaving and coming and going as I please. <laughs> I noticed that you kept uh, sort of vanishing. I thought you were just pooping in the corner or something. <laughs> well, I've also been doing that, yeah. <laughs> Why would you poop in the corner if you could open the door and go to a bathroom? Oh, I was just, it's easier and a shorter length of time. Sometimes you get one of those surprise poops that you don't know is coming. I've so learned just, so much true. about you all. Mm -hmm. Oh, the sage stick. Oh, so hey, Aaron, hey. that's how you were able to get out and meet up with the uh, mirabelle that's right the door was never locked there's poop outside <laughs> that's mine <laughs> jennifer don't stop oh, all right <laughs> this has been a really weird fucking dream yeah Real, it must be the goddamn dream. Sweep everybody, but but I'm a Jennifer. Jennifer, Jennifer, wake up, wake up, wake up. Oh God! Oh my God! I, I was I was in a fugue state. I was writing a song, Michael, a, a song, the best song I've ever written. Okay, I don't care. You just have to get off my couch. Fine. Wait, was the song any good? Yes, it was genius. It was genius. Okay. But um, I didn't know you had a cat. Where where that cat? Did that cat get out of Glass Mirabel's apartment? I didn't. I mean, know it must have. Like I don't. Cats. Know. I didn't think you had a. Pet. As you know, I'm. I I am not to be trusted with any living organism, so it's not mine. The cat keeps looking at me, and I don't like the way it's looking at me. Well, I cannot help you. It's giving me the stink eye. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. The stinky, stinky cat eye. Yes, I know what you mean. Wow, it's larger than life. Anyway, uh, yeah. I'll be working on the song and I might perform it next week at the asylum. We'll see. And scene. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was silly. Thank you all so much for hopping in. <laughs> Thank you for having Come us. Thank you, Amazon. You don't Pretty have to much. Thank you. Oh, God. What, what are they doing here? Thank you so much, uh, Jeremy, Hoove, Ashley, Devin, for uh, um, uh, hopping in, and of course, Jennifer for playing herself. <laughs> uh, we do have a, have a few minutes. Does anybody have anything that they'd like to promote? Uh, tomorrow, uh, there is the um, monthly online improv extravaganza happening um i'll be performing with the clam without a shell i think around like 5 p.m eastern um i'm doing stand-up at like 6 10 eastern yeah yeah as part of it um and i think is cartoonia on um, two later tomorrow uh, i think we'll 
think so. But we're I not the last so. team. Yeah, and a couple of us, I think, are gonna, um, you know, perform with a cartoonia jam as well. We're also we're usually on towards the end, like around like eleven thirty. Really late. Time. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, if you search like improv at its best extravaganza on Facebook, you'll see the whole lineup. So it's tomorrow night. Come check us out. Two online improv shows in a row. Woohoo! Woo Please do. I'm sure it will be. I'm a great. I'm a. Uh, uh, anyone else? I guess uh, I'll. I'll uh, promote something um, for uh, for for Aaron and for me. Uh, we have a show tomorrow. Anyone in the Atlanta area? Um, it's our treasure hunt format. Final Fridays. It's uh, tomorrow at roll call. I think it's at seven or seven thirty. The time's probably on the website. Um, so it's it's happening. It's it'll be fun. Um, check it out. Yes, if you want to see it, go and figure out when and where yourself. We're not doing all the work for you. It's worth it, it is the takeaway, I think. I'll, I'll figure all those details out tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, last, uh, Jennifer. On uh, Monday, February 27th at 7.30, live from the asylum, will be 7.30 uh, p.m. Eastern. Live from the Asylum, we're doing a special on High Wire, High Wire Improv, and with Shalita Chapman as our guest star. Yes, indeed. Uh, that will be awesome, I'm sure. Uh, okay, uh, if nobody has anything else, I'll say thank you all so much, guests, for coming in for our Multiverse episode this season, and yeah. tune in next week for episode nine, where we hopefully have the... Uh, 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 old boring idiots that you all used to back again <laughs> uh and, but until then have a great week and uh see you then have a great week everyone <laughs>